Are you still struggling with the email builder in Go High Level? You're gonna love this. It's a quick tutorial on how to set up your emails in just 10 steps or less. And this is so simple that you'll be able to do this even if you're brand new to Go High Level. By the way, if you still haven't joined our free Facebook group, make sure you go on over to Facebook and check that out. In there, we're gonna interview six and seven figure agency owners. Uh, we're gonna have exclusive trainings each and every week. And then also you get one-on-one -on -one interaction with myself, JC Height, and the entire digital agency hacker team. Looking forward to seeing you over there. So in this training, we'll go over how to set up your emails within your high level account. First, you must go inside the marketing tab. This is where you'll find the emails feature. Now in this specific feature, you'll be able to create templates uh, to incorporate in your campaigns, your workflows, uh, and anything that you're working within your snapshot. For example, if you wanna create a generic email for a product or service that you might utilize for various campaigns, the best thing to do would be to start right here. All right, now the next step, click on create email and you can select already pre-made templates from the snapshot or your account, uh, or you can go ahead and create one from scratch. Now, the next step, once you choose an option, the feature will take you to a dual screen in edit mode, okay? Now, this is gonna be right next to the settings. Uh, this is where you can easily edit content into your email. Now, if you're familiar with the funnel builder, you can find this email uh, feature similar to that in the way that elements are provided as options to incorporate in your email. You've got things like text, uh, image, the uh, uh, different buttons, any types of dividers, social links, or custom code. And you can also divide it into different layouts. Now, the next step, you're gonna wanna click on start from scratch to begin adding your text. As you'll notice, you will work on the left hand side typing out the text and on the right hand side you're going to see the end result and exactly how it's going to look for your clients or your leads or people that are getting these messages now the next step is you can add header tags h1 h2 h3 that's right for my seo people to make different sections within your email now if you want to add custom values this is awesome. So you can provide a generic campaign email template with preset values available, and you can even incorporate trigger links. Now, this is to specifically hyperlink to specific areas or different types of calendars or funnel pages, website, you name it, okay? Now we have another training and SOP on trigger links, so make sure you check that video out. Now the next step, once you are done editing your email, you can head to settings. Make sure to provide a subject for the email in the subject line field. And also you can provide an internal name for the email field if you need to. Now this is more for your own organizational purposes. You can also name the template of the email above the edit slash settings slash sender schedule section. Uh, in this case, we named it template test. Now the next step, you can go ahead and test by going into send or schedule. There are options to you know send now, schedule for later, or send into drip mode. Make sure to check out our other uh, video just on drip mode. You're gonna love that one. Next step, you can also view how the email will look by going into actions next to the send test email on the right hand side and view how the email will be seen either on a phone, tablet or a computer. Uh, now you can click on the view you want to change the respective view. Next step, now that you have your email template set up, you're ready to go back to either the marketing tab and hit under campaigns or under the workflow section. This will allow you to easily input the template that you worked on in the corresponding campaign or workflow. For example, in this case, we're gonna head to campaigns, click on one of your folders where you can select your campaign. 
and next by clicking on edit you can adjust the text or modify as you wish you can also work on your emails in this campaign section but you'll find how easy it is once you click on the template you just created now the next step is simply click on pick the email template now you've plugged in the template and you are good to go Okay guys, thank you so much for tuning in to this video. I hope you found it as awesome as it was to produce it for you guys. Now, if you have anything else you need, feel free to leave a comment below and just ask either if it's a question about this video, if it's another training you wanna see, if it's a workflow, campaign, or snapshot that you want my team to build, awesome. You name it, we'll deliver it, okay? now. That's all I have for today. Make sure you hit the subscribe like button below and awesome. We'll see you on the next training.